What's up, everybody? We're Infected Mushroom. Yes. And we're in the studio. And today, finally talking about our new album, Return to the Sauce, which is coming out this week, Ares. Mm -hmm. Super excited to finally bring you the album. You know, me and Ares worked on it for the last two years. A side trance album after so many years, Ares. You yeah. know? Started the idea after we finished Converting Vegetarians number two. Uh, to do a side trance album, you know, the vibe was there and um, we, we said, you know what, let's do an album that is kind of old school, but old with side trance -y. -y per se, but yeah. with the technology of we today. have today, you yeah. know, when we did the gathering, we didn't have this technology, no. uh, shame, then the gathering will be, well, not better, but sounding maybe better. Anyways, uh, the new album called Return to the Sauce um, and um, has nine tracks on it. This is the first one. And the first one is Flamingo and not Fleming like you see it in all the websites. It's a reason. typo for some reason. The Flamingo is uh, basically the heavyweight of this album or the Project 100 of other album. It's the freestyle track of the album and for the first time we open with a track like that. Yeah. Was usually it's the last track. The last one. There's a big debate usually when we do the order. Mm -hmm. But this time we opened with the Flamingo. It's like the heavyweight of the album, but it's more trancy. Mm -hmm. It's on a bass line with the Juno kind of vibe. And we love this track. So the Flamingo, you know, has the guitars. Tool inspired. As usual, me and Ares, we dig the tool. Uh, a lot of new plugins in this album, of course, are commercial to our own plugins, Manipulator, and I wish, and not only a commercial, they're, they're involved in all the tracks. Yeah. Literally, most of the sound is me gibberishing on the mic, doing some weird stuff, and me and Ares basically manipulating the sound with Manipulator, I wish and a few other plugins a few others so flamingo opens this uh, uh album and for me it's one of my favorite tracks uh, of this album and it was a hard decision to put it in, in the beginning, beginning i hated this track you didn't like it in the beginning i hated it and then you fell no before we finished it and then you fell in love and then uh, i fell in love yeah now it takes time it grows on you it's a very complex track that changes a lot and uh, You need to be uh, in a very good mood and Well, mind. psychedelic trance, here yes. we are, you know, psychedelic. very psychedelic, so you'd like it. Um, and uh, take a good listen, it's the opening of the album. Flamingo, not Flamingo. Okay, second track, Eris. Here we start with the proper side trance. Here. Proper side trance track called Manipulator. Mm -hmm. Because the whole track was done with the plugin, basically, besides the kick and the snare. I think even the bass on maybe, maybe the bass no, but the whole sounding that you hear the pads, the strings, the vocals, the whatever, the guitar, even this sound of this iPhone. Who's calling? I don't know. Was made with manipulator. Yeah. So uh, this track is back to proper side trance, 138 kick and bass line, and let's hear the the cat. Let's hear the cat, which is me. Where's the cat? 2017, Psytrance to the face. Oh yeah. Anyway, very massive track. All the sounds done by Manipulator. Uh, it has a break in the middle that kind of reminds me of Daft Punk. This. Which is me. This is my favorite song, Dying and Rosalind, but never mind. And Air is manipulating the shit out of me. And this is basically what Manipulator is all about. And that's the track. Very Duff Punky break. Yeah. But and let's go to the drop. It sounds better when you say Air has manipulated me. Well, it's, it's, the truth. it's the truth. Yeah. Go. Okay, very psychedelic hardcore side trends to the face. Let's go to the third track, Ares, on the album, which is Return to the Sauce. One of my favorite tracks in the album. Super side trends, super yeah. psy, and works great on the dance floor. And this is really how me and Ares 
look at side trends. This is like side trends how it used to sound, mm -hmm. you know, but with the sound of today. Yep. So, and that's. We actually had Uri here, one of our forum uh, old school people. Touching uh, himself while we're doing the trend. Himself that's a true story. While. True story. Doing, no, I'm joking. He was here. Staying in my house. And it was yeah. Great. True story. Anyways, uh, so that's Return to the Sauce, which the album is named by a very aggressive sidetrack track with a lot of emotion and melody. I like this bass line. Which was not done with Manipulator. No. Without. So yeah, Return to the Sauce is the third track of the album and the theme track of this album. Yeah, let's go to the fourth track, Ares. Ah. Fourth track of the album is called Groove Attack. Groove Attack, again, side trance with a little bit of vocals distorted with manipulator and stuff. But what me and Ares really like about this track, it's the kick and the bass line on the one uh, with a guitar, actually, which is very hard to do. Yeah, this is our take on country psy trance style. So groove Psy-tree. attack psy country? Never mind. Okay. Anyways, groove attack number four. Very massive track to the dance floor. Oh, and we actually used Hey. Hey hey. So you can disconnect it? No, disconnect a little bit of a cyclone. No, here we go, here we go, let's try it. A little bit of cyclone machine, which we got from the guys of Basebot, uh, which sound really like the TV303, but on steroids. And um, yeah, we, we had fun playing with it. Yeah. So that's on that track as well. And uh, basically this is Groove Attack. Yeah. Uh, very good side trance track, and I hope you like it. Track number five, Eris. Where are we? Oh, this is super old school remix. So, too. Gravity Waves remake or remix, call it whatever you want. Uh, me and Erez were uh, building this new studio and we found a box of CDs that back in the day when you used to save tracks or stems as you call it today, you had to burn it on CDs. Yeah. So we were looking at uh, this uh, box and we found Gravity Waves, one of our very old and famous tracks done with Xerox actually. The remix to it. We remixed Xerox back in the day. And uh, this is a very favorite track by all the side trends, kind of new genre of this uh, lately calling it um, retro sets. So me and Eris decided to rebuild Gravity Waves and keep with Xerox. It, yeah, we, we did with Xerox. Because it was such a big success. After this track, he opened a printer company. A printer company. Yeah. And now he has a, now he has printer. If you yeah. know what Xerox yeah. is, but never mind. Yeah. Anyways, we we did this track basically pretty much close to the original. So a lot of the original sounds are in here. New bass like this one. Psst. You remember with what we did this sound there is generator. Generator. It's the pre-version of Reactor. Pre-version of Reactor by Native Instruments. Yeah, so Native Instruments it was amazing. Make, they do amazing stuff. So Gravity Waves 147 side trends to the face with the original sound and a bit new ones. And it's one of the dance floor bombs of this album. And let's go to the original. So much love, Ares. So much love. From 200 years ago. So the original sounds of Gravity Waves are in here. Kick and bass are from this era. And it's 147, super dance floor track and basically similar to the original. So I think all of you that are missing like the old school infected mushroom are gonna dig this track a lot. Next. Okay, Demons of Pain, one of our favorite tracks from Converting Vegetarians number two sure. is getting a side trance version over here. Uh, so we took a very uh, down tempo track mm -hmm. and turned it into a 145 bomber to the dance floor. Again, very side trance, kick and bass line side trance. The vocals are new here, recorded with Manipulator and I Wish. And uh, again, dance floor bomb. And let's listen. A 
again. Boom. Yeah, so uh, we love Demons of Pain and this is another version for this track uh, and it ends very massively with a rise to the spaceship. All score infected mushroom, distortion, super rise to the face and when I say to the face, it doesn't stop at the end, it just goes in. I love it. Listen to these fingers. You get these fingers? This is 20 years ago fingers. Still working today. Still. Still. Well, not, not, as, not as 20 years ago. Anyway. So, Demons of Pain. Uh, you know, just another version. And I'm sure you're gonna love this track. Okay, what is the next track, Erez? So bring us, so bring us there to the next track. You're gonna hate it. Bring it. Okay. This next track like is the poem, longest like, like poem. Yeah. Like you're talking poem, track, poem. Yeah. Amazing. So this next track is Milosh. We will not explain the meaning behind let's the explain. You know, it's, it's too difficult. It's too difficult. Let's, let's, let's leave it as a mystery. Let's Why? leave it as a mystery. Because people people need some mystery airs. You don't need to give them everything. Why? On a spoon. No. Just share with so them Milosh the is evil, a evil Milosh truth. is a mystery. And we will we'll stay as a mystery. Now, what, what can I tell you about this track? It's the longest track in that. It's is 11 it? minutes, Ares. Really? Yes, it's longer even than the, the first track of the album. It's like Lord of the Rings. Yes, 11 minutes of completely crazy side trains. Great, yeah. super melodies. This, for me, has the vibe of symphonic, especially with the lid and the distortion. And uh, it's uh, longer longer than an album this yeah. track but we love it and Milos I already see people uh, from the previews are raving about it and it's um, very psychedelic track yeah but not as much as this pistachio no, pistachio is amazing let's go, let's go to the middle of the track of me no let's <laughs> no let's, <laughs> let's do, you know what <laughs> let's listen the whole 11 yeah, let's do that let's go for it Yo, are you ready? One second. <laughs> yeah. Symphonic vibe, as I mentioned. I never, never felt about this one. Yeah, now you now, now you feel the vibe. You feel the vibe of symphonic. Milos, um, amazing Citron track, and I hope you like it. Let's go to the next track, Ares. What's the next track in the album? It's still fucking me off. Yeah, me off the fiber. Next track. What about this track, Harris? <laughs> Let me tell you. Okay. <laughs> about this track. The next track. I'll explain. Nutmeg. It's a special sauce that to put in my hummus. It's not a sauce, it's a spice. It's kind of a spice, not a spice. And uh, if you do too much of it, you know what's happen. gonna happen. Yeah, so anyways, uh, this track came out as a single and uh, all of you like it. So, uh, one of our favorite side trends track. Uh, what I will say, this kick and bass line is kind of... Uh, this one? Yeah, the beginning is kind of a Spongo, old school one-on-one -on -one kick and bass line, which we like. More of a listening gen, which And And... Uh, yeah, this is a very side kind of one of the track. best albums ever. The Long Deranger. The Long Deranger, definitely. So this track is influenced from that album. If you don't know the Long Deranger, go check it out. And uh, yeah, this track came out, and uh, you already like it, so not me. And what finishes the album is? Oh wait, 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 wait! Give him some bells. Give him some love. I feel like you're rushing the end of this. No, uh, no, I love it. I love it. You know, give him some love. Who doesn't like love? I know. Not Mick. Okay, next. Okay, the last track of the album, which was the first single, is called Liquid Smoke. Again, Liquid Smoke is? Is uh, amazing, actually liquid that you put to 
meats and whatever. Yeah, that's why it's returned to the, the sauce. Smoke stuff. There's a lot of sauces. Actually, liquid smoke is pretty good. There's a lot of you sauces in this album, you know? Fun. Again, side trance, a lot of gates, a little bit of piano in this album as well. Uh, very side trancey kind of track with a major rise in the middle areas. And this is basically what ends the album. So the album Return to the Source is coming out uh, in Omega, our old school uh, label of side trance of our good friend Ayal, yeah. uh, putting it out. And it's no more a suitable place for an album uh, of side trance to mm -hmm. come out in. Uh, back and this to album was the first time mastered by Domestic, another side trance wizard. Yeah, you know. So this album was not mastered by us for, for the, the first, first time. time. We gave it to Domestic to master. He's done a great job. And he mastered the album, and um, Omega is putting it out. And uh, you can have it from this Friday, and I hope everybody is liking it as much as we do. And me and Erez, we really like it because we play it a lot in the, in the last two years, yeah. and Psytrance is kind of back. So uh, for us, it never went away, but we, we went away. So, but anyways, we had fun doing this album. I hope you like it, and this is Return to the Songs. See you guys, we love you.